Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word. And the Daily Prophetic Word for Tuesday, the 16th of July 2019, is Escape, not the Rapture. But before we start, please subscribe, like, click the bell icon, and share all of our videos with your friends and families. And as usual, at the end of the Daily Prophetic Word, we will give another <coughs> part of our 95 thesis and a philosophical pointer out of our Book of Love. But let us continue now with the Daily Prophetic Word. Escape, not the rapture. The taking of my bride is an escape from the woes that will come onto the earth. It is not the rapture of my remnant. It is not the great harvest that will take place at the sixth seal. It is not the time of the multitude closed in white. It is an escape, not a rapture. My bride will vanish like a thief in the night. People will look for their relatives and their children, but they will not find them. My bride will be taken to my father's house and will meet me in the air, in the same manner as I ascended in the clouds. It is an escape. Many Christians believe that this is a rapture mentioned in the scriptures, but the rapture time is not at hand. After I have taken my bride, I will break the seals and the time for my remnant will begin and it will end with the rapture at the holy mountain. And this was the daily prophetic word for Tuesday, the 16th of July, 2019. I thought about this word was given by the Holy Spirit and it looks like that there is a difference in in time maybe not even in places if I hear that the people are vanishing that could be because they are maybe still somewhere around this earth but in another time in, yeah, in another time period or something like that. It's definitely very interesting to see what will happen in the next few days. I pray that you are all accounted worthy and that you are all part of the bride. But if not, then you know I'm here for you. And now let me continue with our book of love and with the next thesis. So this is the third thesis of the restoration, the reformation of the church. What does reading the scriptures and talking about it bring forth? Nothing, when no action follows. Think about it. Listen to it again and then think about it. And now the next philosophical pointer. Receive every religion, every sect, every race, and every face into your societies, because God is great, and so is his love. Now to this point I have to add something. This has nothing to do with tolerating everybody's religion. Jesus is not about religion. Jesus is about the kingdom and about the love of the Father. And this pointer does not say that you should bring all religion as they are in one thing together. This says that you should not close your doors towards anybody from any religion. They will come and they will learn the understanding about Jesus Christ and the heavenly kingdom. Thank you that you are listening to the words of wisdom and also to the daily prophetic words given by the Holy Spirit. My name is Michael. I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Past Movement Foundation. And I hope I will meet you again tomorrow for the next daily prophetic word. May God bless you and your family abundantly. Have a great day. Maranatha.